Hello and welcome to this video tutorial on how to use data validation rules in Microsoft Excel. This feature is an excellent defense against data entry typos. I'll show you how to create a data validation rule using our cow data spreadsheet. In this case, I think that all my cows weighed at least 500 pounds on the 205th day and I want to be sure I didn't enter any cattle weighing a lot less than that because it will affect my averages. First, highlight the cells you wish to add a rule to. Then click the Data tab and the Data Validation button. Next you will choose the category of the rule you want in the Allow drop-down list. So I'm going to allow a whole number and it needs to be equal to or greater than 500 and click OK. Well, I don't see anything different in my column. So I need for Excel to tell me where the numbers are that are less than 500. So I'm going to click on data validation again. And this time I'm going to ask it to circle the invalid data. Now I see that I have a few cows that weighed in under 500 pounds. And they weighed 494 pounds, so they're probably just fine. But if I had accidentally typed in something like 253, instead of 523, uh, you can see how that would have affected my average. So this is a useful tool for preventing that. Now I can click on data validation again, clear the validation circles, and they're gone. I hope you found this tutorial useful and learned something new. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video.